An emotional day in Heihara as a local minister and teacher finally returns home. Eric Curitan spent two months in the hospital while battling COVID-19. ABC 27 Chantel Navarro shows us why dozens gathered on his driveway to welcome him home. From cheers to tears, Eric Curitan was greeted by a crowd of loving community members Saturday when he finally returned home for the first time in two months following a tough battle with COVID-19. The ambulance got there and I remember talking to the two attendants and that's the last thing I remember till the 2nd of February. Family, friends, students and co-workers all gathering on his driveway to celebrate the victory. He spent his life helping the community. Uh, preacher, teacher, military, he's always doing something for someone. And it's great to see the community he supported come back and support him. He is a very benevolent hearted individual and I thought that I need to show my benevolence towards him. We work together in various capacities and my husband is an elder in the church and so he is my brother in Christ and I had to support him because he supports all of us. His wife Wanda says these past few months were filled with a lot of moments where she didn't know what was going to happen next. Three times I was told my husband's not going to make it. But he's a living testimony that God is more than able and I want others to know that God is more than able. Faith, Eric says, is what made the return possible. It took me for the full ride. But God brought me through. Health leaders say Lowndes County still remains a high risk area when it comes to COVID-19. So for anybody else who finds himself battling the virus, Curitan says. Don't give up. Just don't give up. As much as lie within you, keep the faith. Don't give up. That was Chantel Navarro reporting.